What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Easy Money X. Before we get into it, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, but of course. Alright, so we got some new news from the Madden 21 department and it's not looking good. In fact, it's looking very bad. EA Sports, the whole Madden 21 dev team sold us. They sold us out. So as we all know, once a week, the uh, EA Sports team, the Madden dev team, whoever it is, they come out with their weekly notes. They call them the gridiron notes. And they just give updates on the game. Um, and right now they're giving updates on Madden 21. You know, tr trying to hype us up. Up until now, they've done an okay job, you know? And they announced last week, today would be the day where they finally go over franchise mode, the new additions, anything and everything that can possibly innovate with franchise mode. Today was the day they were gonna go over it. So, uh... Let's just get into this. Now the whole first half of the notes are about Face of the Franchise 2, so we're gonna skim through this pretty fast, but I will have the link in the bio for those that, you know, wanna read through it very, you know, slowly, take their time. Now nothing out of, the, there's nothing out of the normal here, you know, start off in high school, then you go to college, and then you go to the combine, and then bing, Madden puts you off on your own. You're going to be going through some storylines as well. Franchise Savior, Next Man Up, Understudy, Bitter Rivals, Dream Team. Once again, link's gonna be on the bio if you wanna read into these uh, more specifically. Let's keep going on. All right, they also have the comeback, Turf War and Into the Sunset and accompanied by special guest, Snoop Dogg and Rich Eisen. Interesting. So then they have the names of the, uh, the created players that's gonna be in your story mode. Tommy Matthews, Reggie Brown, Coach Red O'Brien, and Coach Fetu Vatai. Now they put a lot of work into a game mode we only play for a week two at the most but you know maybe this year they changed it up to the point where we're gonna be playing this all all season you know like hopefully you don't give us our character i want to make my own character i don't want to be given a character and i want to pick where he plays i want to play defense i don't want to be a quarterback i don't want to be a running back i want to play defense that's what i play all right now what we've all been waiting for madden 21 classic franchise mode updates now this is the game mode we all play this is the most played game mode in madden i know everyone thinks it's ultimate team i know madden thinks it's ultimate team but this is the classic right here this is why we play whether it's in your own career franchise mode whether you're in a league with your homies franchise mode franchise mode is you know the one that needs the most innovation it's the most played game mode now let's take a look at the updates interesting they call it updates almost like a patch right this is a brand new game, and they're treating it like a patch. New X Factors coming into the franchise mode. Expanded wildcard playoff round, you know, just a match real life. Updated rookie contract amounts. Retuned positions available abilities. Fixed, look at this. Fixed multiple cases and logic of players considered for a dev trait. That's a patch note. That's not a new feature, that's a patch note. Madden, you sold. Uh, you know what? Let's keep going. Maybe I'm a, maybe I'm gonna see something I haven't seen yet. Okay. Updates to all team back in dev chart philosophies. Added position specific offensive linemen. Um. Okay, this makes me laugh right here. Fixed issue where defensive playbook and schemes for our fictional coaches would be misaligned. Fixed issue. This is the new game. Why are you? So they're just putting the same franchise mode in Madden 21 no new there's no innovations here someone show me the innovation none only thing they did was show love to face of the franchise and it's not even a game mode people played last year every other game they can tell you know what game modes were the most played in their game and they and they capitalize off that ea sports sold me ea sports sold us out but then you know it's funny they have the nerve to say Hey, be on the lookout. Our new gridiron notes are coming July 14th. Who cares? You sold. This is what we all wanted right here. Franchise mode. You sold us. You gave us a patch for a whole new game. EA Sports, you sold me. You let me down. You let the community down. Actually, you know what? Let's take a live look in on the community right now, shall we? Let's see. Maybe I'm being harsh, you know? I've been told, hey, sometimes you're just a little too harsh. So let's have a live look in on the community. Let's see what they say. Popular YouTuber RBT tweets, Oh look, Madden 21, leaked screenshots. And that's Madden from this year. Actually, it might even be Madden from last year. I mean, who the hell knows? All right, uh, Madden 21, no franchise at all, just a patch. That's exactly what I said. Marcus Whitman, um, don't buy Madden 21. 
we'll see i gotta see what else they got ea sports said bleep you to everyone uh yeah they did they did quintonio brown just the patch and look at the memes people are letting the memes go that's how you know you sold the community when one no everyone is tweeting the same thing and two they got the memes going out but let's hear from you guys uh comment below what you guys are expecting did madden sell you am i being too tough on them i don't know but it's your man easy money x and i'm out